Undoubtedly, the cutest bat in Costa Rica is also one of the rarest, the white tent bat, or Honduran white bat. These little fruit-feeding bats range from Honduras just into Panama on the Atlantic Slope in lowland rainforest and range up to 700 meters. To find a white tent bat, you have to locate its tent, which is usually under a heliconia leaf. These bats cut the leaf so that falls down providing a more secure and drier roost where they spend the day sleeping. It's quite an effort to cut the tough rib of the heliconia leaf. These bats are rare, primarily due to habitat loss, which of course affects all species, like this Mexican tree frog that changes its color with its moods. One has to check many, many leaves before finding another white tent bat condominium. Groups vary from two to eight individuals. Groups are of mixed sexes, except for females that are nursing pups, at which time the males take off. Another rare species is the stained glass palm. The long-billed hermit is not so rare. White tent bats prefer habitats along rivers with plenty of heliconias and other large leaf plants. The faciated tiger heron also likes rivers through primary rainforest. So many creatures in the tropical rainforest spend their daytime sleeping. However, butterflies are an exception, like this Euromedia clearwing butterfly. Notice how the bats are camouflaged when the light comes from above, which the sun usually does. And fortunately, bat predators don't carry flashlights. After the sun sets, the bats leave the roost in search of food. Like many bats that roost together in small groups, they often break up mix with other bats from different roosts and have new roommates for a while. Biologists call this fission-fusion sociality. Besides the genetic benefits, individuals learn from their new roommates about things like where to find fruits and how to evade predators. Often friendships are made and these buddies move from roost to roost together. A single pup is raised every year, and it has been observed that females, other than the mother, will help feed the pup. <laughs> the iconic strawberry poison dart frog is a colorful species in this hot lowland forest. Oh, there's another tent. This one's popular. There they go. In slow motion, one can see that the wings are black. Ah, it's nice to sleep in. Unlike most fruit-feeding bats, the white tent bat seems very restricted to feeding on a particular fig tree, Ficus columbrina. 